We are on campus at Providence College with the big man. He's on the Kareem Abdul-Jabbar watch list. He's a preseason all Big East first team selection. It is the Providence Friars, Nate Watson. And we're outside the Ruane Fryer Development Center, Nate. This was not here when you were a freshman. Mm -hmm. It was being built. What kind of a difference has it made? Uh, it's definitely made a, a big difference in terms of uh, my conditioning wise. and. Um, you know, I'm always in there in the hydro tank, the float tank, the nap pods. Whenever I'm sleeping, I just go in there and take a nap. And so, you know, I definitely love this and what they've done to this facility. And um, so, yeah, I'm very appreciative. You want to take a walk? Yeah, let's take a walk. All right. For you, coming back here, how easy of a decision was it? Uh, it was very easy. I mean, last year I didn't play in front of fans, and I really miss, you know, the Friar fans, just the energy and the dunk. And uh, so coming back was definitely an easy decision. Definitely I wanted to do what's best for me in terms of uh, my future and what's best for the program. We're walking by this little lobby, everyone's staring at you. I, I know, it's kind of kind of awkward, but I mean, I'm used to it. You're used to getting stared at around yeah, here. Yeah, you know, I'm, I'm a giant around campus, so. That's exactly yeah. right. Um, to be a big man, mm -hmm. tell us what that's like in college basketball, how you go about your daily business. Uh, well, definitely. You know, society doesn't think us big men are, you know, really, you know, they, they think we should all just shoot threes. I, I beg a differ. I don't think we have to, you know, shoot threes in order to be a good big man in today's mm -hmm. game. I mean, obviously, you look at last year, uh, not to be cocky or anything, but I mean, I did have a okay season there. I averaged 16.9 points without shooting a single three. Remember that, you know, so, <laughs> yeah, I mean, I definitely think, um, you know, if you're, if you have a good motor, you know, you, um, outwork your opponent you definitely I think being a big man is definitely good nowadays. How is this Friars team different? Um, well this year um, we definitely have a lot more you know older pieces uh, mm -hmm. we have a lot more leaders this year including myself um, you know guys uh, we, we really all want the same goal this year you know we lost David and uh, he's chasing his dream so I'm happy for him but you know we uh, got Al Dorm you know transfer from Indiana and got Justin a uh, transfer from South Carolina so we're definitely uh, Trying to make big moves this year, and I'm really happy that these guys came. You're a sharp dressed man. I think so. You know, I got, got these shoes on. I didn't pay for. Yeah, it. what? You didn't pay for those? No, I didn't pay for okay. these. Okay. Uh, what kind of shoes are they? Oh, uh, these are just uh, Nike Jordans. Yeah. Uh, retro ones. What's your favorite pair of shoes? Favorite pair of shoes actually are my Yeezys. I love Yeezys. They're very comfortable. My brother has a pair. He does? Oh, wow. I went and golfed in them last year and got reamed out. <laughs> yeah, you can't golf in Yeezys. Yeah, that was a bad decision by me. <laughs> to someone who's never been in the Dunkin' Donuts Center, mm -hmm. what is it like on a game day? Um, it's definitely energetic. I mean, the fans are loud to the point where the seats are vibrating. <laughs> um, so I would say uh, if someone's coming to the dunk, definitely expect some you know, rowdy fans. Uh, they definitely tell you <laughs> if you're doing something wrong. We definitely <laughs> praise you if you're doing something right. So that's what I love about them. Good luck this year. Thank you.